Wrong button. <laughs> hey, how's it going, everybody? Uh, welcome back to the Underdogs. I'm Flinger Foo, and oh, hold on. I was actually gonna start this off in uh, in a different way. I have had a vision. I have slept, and when I awoke, I realized there comes a time in every Ark survivor's life when they must venture forth and pursue a haircut. So join me today, fellow people, as we decide how the hell we're gonna find Obsidian. It may be rough, it may be tough. We may tumble down a few cliffs. We may end up becoming raptor poop or spider poop or scorpion poop. Some sort of poop. We may be excreted from some sort of external or, hold on, hold on, cloaca. That would be the proper term, right? Some sort of dinosaur's butt in a gooey substance today. That could be the thing that we may end up doing. And that kind of is, uh, well, it's not really the goal, but if it does happen, then it happens. Whatever happens, it happens, all right? This is one of those, you know, hey, this is the obsidian over here. You want to come get it? Mess around and find out. Come on, let's do this. All right, so uh, the goal today is we are going to get obsidian, and I need to put, uh, I mean, we're getting quite a bit of metal in there. Just say it. All right, I do believe what I'm going to do, I'm going to take Bob. Um, let's get a little bit more meat burning. Not meat burning. All right, let's put this over in here. Down here. All right, uh, we're going to need a little bit more. Wow, we're actually running low on trees here. At least we have to walk. Oh, that's a good 30 feet. Bob, what have you done to the island? Don't look away. This is all you, man. You're the one that cut down all these trees. Never mind the axe in my hand. You can't bring that up. That's not part of your argument. Bam! Not in my hand anymore. See? All right. Get some trees. So we can get that nice bamboo smoke on our uh, meat while we're cooking it. There she blows, and... Ha <laughs> ha! Et voila. All right, uh, let's see. There, oh, and also I ended up looting a, uh, a loot drop over there the other day when I went over to go get a screenshot, and it had two parachutes and a bow in it. So I've got, like, four bows now. Not bad. All right, um, campfire, you're in charge. Don't let the furnace boss you around. All right, cool, gotcha. Let's get over here, and let's, uh, go get back across the water, and let's go see if we can meet up, because that's where I left, uh, Princess over there, and then we've also got the Raptor Posse over there. Or, uh, Tweedledee, Tweedledum, and, uh, forgot his name. Was it Ted? Because that would go so perfect with that. Oh, my God. Tweedledee, Tweedledum, and Ted. If I haven't named them that, I will totally name them that. I'm just saying. All right? So let's get over there, and let's go see if we can uh, get some stuff. Also, we're going to head down over yonder towards the cave system. How a Ted... You know, the noises that come off of uh, Bob while we're doing this mean... Uh, he, I'm not sure what's going on, but I think he's due for an oil change. His check engine light came on the other day, and it was kind of scary. I didn't know if we were going to be able to make it off the interstate. Because we're going so fast, right? Yes. All right, let's see. Oh, I, I'm, I need more stamina before we... Had take out on this venture, and there is a Basilosaurus down there, which means there's going to be a bunch of uh, sharp, pointy things that decide they want to eat us if we get too close. These sharp, pointy things! That's a fish. Alright, see, can we make it? Really, the only thing that's going to stop us is an alpha shark at this point. There is a shark, not an alpha. All right, let's get back up here. 
Snyderia would also be bad. Having, uh, like, oh. Okay, a manta could be <laughs> potentially bad, too. Um, that shark coming? Uh, shark's coming to get a bite! Dude! You just don't sneak up on people like that! Ouch! Stop! Dude! We were cool! All the way up until this very moment. I was about to name you, and you were gonna be like my buddy, and, you know, it was... It there was some stuff involved, man. Dude, we were getting like a moment. We were building a rapport. Oh. You're level 40. We may have to come back and get you. You're low enough level where I won't have to worry about you running off. That tapas jar just keeps coming back. It's like taunting me. And it's a 110, too. Uh, I mean, tapajars, they're... While they are good, they are very rarely used all that much. I mean, yeah. So I could. But I do think Pelagornis is probably the way I'm going to do it. All right. Bob, you're going on here. Oh. Okay. All right. Princess. You are going on here. Really? I did name him Ted! Oh yeah! Alright! See, it's been like a couple like minutes since I named you. So yeah! Alright! Brain farts and all that! Yeah! Alright, Tweedledee, Tweedledum, and Ted. Perfect! Alright, uh, let's see. Let's get you some hit points. Get you some hit points. I comp. You know, if I had any prime me, I would just tame you right now. Your tails are in the way. I'm trying to uh, level up Ted, guys. Come on. Hello. Do we have any prime meat? Can we get any prime meat? I don't know. All right. All right. I'm just going to stick you right inside Bob's butt over here. That way they're the raptor. Hello. Okay. Um. And there you go. Alright, princess. Don't fall off. Yeah, um. Compy, if I had prime meat, I would take... You guys see that? That Pteranodon had found the one and only sandbar over there. Oh my gosh. Alright. Okay, so we're gonna see if we can head our way down here. And my only way of knowing if Princess is still on, on the boat. Really? Are you trying, are you trying to say you want a piece of this? But yeah, my only way of know of knowing if Princess is still on the raft is if the raptors are still here. And I just remembered lead sick this sort of thing. I mean, I'm not absolutely terrified of them because, I mean, face it, I'll live. I mean, maybe if a lead sick this gets me, all depends. But I just don't want to lose the raft. Yeah, you tell him, Raptor. That was Ted, right? You're... Yeah, okay. Ted's the brains of the operation. If there were brains in Raptors, but there's really not. But I'm... I should probably be whispering that so he doesn't get offended. Hello, Iguanodon. Okay, now that was Tweedledum. I heard you. That was pr Princess. You burp well. Nice. Good job, Princess. Tweedledum, you are in the way. All right, who's the dumber one? Tweedledum or me? On that aspect. 15. No, thank you. 
All right, and here we go. Now, there's a couple different ways of getting in. That's a beaver. There's a couple different ways of getting inside of this cave. Now, there's a left passage and a right passage. I think we're going to go through the right passage. But the right passage, even though the left passage can be kind of dangerous, I think the right passage is even more dangerous. All right. I like this. Hey, Bob, you got a level. Hey. All right. All right, Princess, you're coming with me. Bob's still in the level up animation. Come on. All right, now we're taking the whole force here because I have a feeling we're gonna need it. Now, right up inside of here. Now, here, let me show you on the map. Right here, this is where we're at. And we're going right up inside of here. Up into that thicket up there. I should probably make a torch. You know what? Let's make a torch. We're going to need a torch before we go. Sound of all you guys... You guys are loud. I'm just saying. All right? We're, we ain't sneaking up on nothing. Water's good, so. All right. And metal from that. Wow. Okay. That's a lot of metal. All right, get him, Bob. All right, Bob will be the bulldozer. And everybody else is kind of just following along. Alright, now Princess, you're the leader of the pack. But I have a feeling that if things go bad, you're probably going to be the first to die. Alright, now we're just going to follow this ravine. Keep it on our left. And just work our way through here. Now... Alphas do spawn here, and if Alpha spawns here, we're kind of screwed. Come on, guys. Moshops, Lysosaurus. And the only reason right now why I'm riding Bob instead of Princess is because Bob's the slowest one. Work our way up here. I heard a foo. Where's the foo? Hear you. See the foo. I have seen the foo. Mate boosted too. That one's level 40. Where's the up? Over here?
I'm gonna get this guy. Because it will actually help us out quite a bit. Inside the cave, his ability to snare things will really help us out. I mean, not as much as some things, but yeah. Alright, you're not mate boosted anymore. That's what I was worried about, right there. But, they took out the Carno. That's a huge plus. Alright, so I know we can take out a level 10 Carno. That's pretty good. I want to go take a look, see uh, um, Princess's health and then all the Raptor's health. I have a feeling the Raptor's good. Hello. Really? All right, man. I have a feeling all the raptors are probably going to die in this little cave adventure. There we go! Now, this is the second food we've gotten so far, so this is food too. Come here. All right, come on! I got turned around. Which? There we go! All right! Level 90 stupid raptor wants to come over and uh, pick a fight with me. I will gladly tame it. Why am I stuck on you? I put everyone on neutral. Your health is way low. Right. Although you do have a prime meat. We'll use that. Nice. Get your health healed up. Two more prime meat. And then your health healed up. Princess, how you doing? You're the one I'm mostly worried about because you just can't heal her up. Okay. And this one's up, so we're just going to call it Derp-a-Derp. So we've got Tweedledee, Tweedledum, and Derp-a-Derp. Kind of digging it. Come on, Derp. All right, get over this way. Get you unstuck. All right, get you over here. All right, now we're on the road again. Anybody know any uh, little tunes we're getting going? That's right, Foo. So, we got a new monkey, we got a new, uh, raptor, and, uh, hopefully we don't die right away. And here's the cave entrance. And I do want to see if the turtle can even fit in there. <laughs> Suck it, everybody who's not a turtle. The turtle can fit in. All right, come on, guys. All right, let's go get a campfire set up right here. I'll be... Really? Can I get through? 
Thank you. All right, let's go get a few things set up. All right, let's get a campfire going. What does it take for a bed? Fiber and hide. I'm not sure we can even put down a bed in here. And we can put this down here. It'd give us a little bit of illumination. There we go. See, we can see stuff now. And seeing stuff solves a lot of our problems. Thank you, Dad. Okay, to be all done. All right. Do you have any? Do not have fiber on you. Okay. Right back, guys. You get my head out of the cave. Now this is where having a foo on your shoulder is very important because if something comes up and decides it wants to eat you, the foo will throw a poop at it and snare it and then we can run away. Although I will uh, probably be looking for a different, because face it, monkeys are pretty good. Uh, so I mean, but then again, I don't think everybody leans on them nearly as heavily as I do. Okay, so. Bed. We can't put the bed down in here. We're gonna need a... Okay, one more thing. Hey, okay, run back inside. Let's see, can we actually do this? Oh, we can, okay. Okay, so, honestly, I want to see just how far the turtle will go. If the turtle can go in, I'll, I want to see if the turtle is viable here. Although I have a feeling the turtle's probably going to get stuck underneath some of this stuff. So far, so good. Yeah, I hear you, Foo. Alright, I have to keep an eye out for Megalania. Bob, you're freaking me out with those noises. I'm amazed Bob can go down this far. Megalania? Okay. That's a poop. There was wall poop right there. There's a megalania right there. Level 60. Okay. How do, do I think Bob can take a Megalania? I may want to go get a Raptor or two.
Yeah, let's back up a little bit and let's go get raptors. I Because if the raptors die, I don't care. Um, yeah, they do help out with quite a bit of DPS, but then again, if they're not helping out with the DPS, then they're not helping out with the DPS. So I'm going to go get them really quick. All right, we're just going to leave Princess up here for now, I think. And we'll get these guys down here, and these guys will come do our fighting for us. Because there's Arthur and all sorts of bad stuff around here. You guys are just jumping all over the place, aren't you? You guys are just raring to go, huh? All right. All right, so uh, five prime meat to the raptor who walks out alive. I'm just saying, all right? Hey, here they go. Get them. Wow, they are really tearing that thing to shreds. Oh, there was two of them. And there should be some spiders over here. A scorpion. Get him, foo! Don't push him over the edge, guys. You know, this place would actually be a... Hello. This place would actually be a good spot for a base. Oh. Oh, no! Ted! Not Tweedledee! Run away! Our raptors are dying! Derp and derp! All of our raptors have died and there's a Megalosaurus right there. Come around the corner. Hopefully we can uh, get any snakes one at a time. Yeah, the snakes are right at where we want to get... Okay, one snake right here. Come on. There you go, Foo. Yeah, this is a good spot. You know, I never once in a million years thought I would be caving on a turtle. That was 150. Another snake over here. You can hear him. There he is. Thank you, Foo. Oh, what level are you? 85. Now, that is the stuff of nightmare. Please don't turn dark while I'm in. All right, so at least the raptors took out most of this stuff. We should be getting up on the obsidian here very soon. Right here we are. There's one, two. Come on. Three, four. Thank you, foo. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was terrifying. I mean, Bob took it like a champ, though. Hey, Bob.
Oh, good. My thoughts exactly. See that? Yep. Okay. Should be enough. And Bob's over encumbered. I think that's probably too much. Uh oh, two stank, three stanks. We may need to run. One stank dead. Come on. More worried about Bob falling asleep. Two two stanks. All right, snakes are dead. All right, let's get our butt out of here. Oh my gosh, hopefully we can get past that Megalosaurus. All right, so... Bob succeeded where the raptors failed. Oh, man. And we gotta give that guy a wide berth, because if you still get too close, he'll, he will aggro. But you have to get wicked close. Oh, man. Okay, and your torpor just keeps going up and up and up. Okay, there it goes. It stopped. Yeah, I was thinking, hey, don't fall asleep, man. Don't fall asleep, dude. Wow. So, can you cave on a turtle? Yeah, it's not the ideal thing, but you totally can do it. You can, you can use it to go get your uh, obsidian. And that's what matters, right? Now we need to get out of here with Princess. Wow. All right. Good job, Evil Bob. I didn't even realize I had a bunch of stimberries in my inventory. Okay, so Bob wouldn't have passed out, but yeah. Well, he probably would have, although I... Because I didn't realize I had them in there until I just threw them out. So, yeah. All right, Princess. Um... We made it! Yay! Don't worry. Uh, yeah. Don't get mad at me because the others aren't with us. I know they were your posse. But I'm sorry, right? All right, come on, princess. Let's get our butt out of here. No matter how many times you look, they're not coming. I'm sorry. Sorry. Hopefully we can get out of here. Because this place does I mean uh, you have all sorts of stuff that drop off the side. So yeah, like Carnos, Raptors, Alpha Raptors, Alpha Carnos, all sorts of stuff will drop in here. Theries drop in here. A Theri would waste us. Really, a Steely Bird? I've had enough. Of you guys at the beach. Thank you. Let's right, get out of here.
blue drop. This is going to give us some good stuff to make up for our, uh, our raptor posse that we lost. Probably not. I'm still going to open it. Hey! Water jar blueprint. And just as my torch broke. Okay, we've got a Mo Shops and a Lysosaurus just walking around here. So, yeah, I'm feeling this is pretty uh, tame right here. Came in this way, right? Yeah, I came in this way. I just want to make sure where the raft is. And the spot that's right down here... Like I said um, in a previous episode, it's a really good spot to build a base. So I may actually do that and then move the other um, guys over with the raft. And then also we have access to the metal over on Herbivore Island. So this would be a nice centralized location for us. Pretty tame as well. Plus, also there's beavers and beaver dams just right up around the way. Come on, princess. But we need to head our um, butt back to um, Herbivore Island just where we can get uh, our stuff made. And But I mean by stuff is our scissors. Because that is like absolutely important. And also, is it just me or um, every time I tame a foo so far in this series, something dies? You... First time was the food. This time it was the entire um, raptor posse. But they also... They did not die in vain. They they got us our haircut. I'm just saying. So, you know, let's pour one out for the um, for the stupid raptors. Just saying. Alright. Alright, and we're off. And I still would not mind getting a duck. Esperonis would be a good shoulder mount for this, or shoulder pet for this uh, series. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can make it. We get hit by leads. We get hit by leads. Okay, uh, we can release uh, from full clinch mode. Okay, all right, good job. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I was fully clinched on that one. All right, and here we go. Good job, Bob. Dude, you've been amazing, man. Put all this stuff in here. Scissors. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Watch out, feel me. I'll give you a haircut. I'm not sure what hair I'm going to cut, but, you know. Hey, we got a level. All right, let's see. Ponytail. And. Wow, I can't believe our beard was that long. Holy wow. There we go. Yeah. And we got human hair. All right, so. Mission accomplished. All right, so we got haircuts, we got foo, uh, the raptor pack died, yay. Um, no. Um, <laughs> and we made it across the channel without getting hit by leads. All right, so hey, I had a lot of fun today. I hope you guys did. If you haven't already, make sure you click that um, like button. I really appreciate it. If you're new around here, subscribe. Until next time, this is Flicker Foo. And take it easy, everybody. And Foo, don't you pretend for a moment I didn't see that poop rolling down my shoulder. All right? I mean, and while I was talking, too. 
really couldn't even say anything, man. Gosh, dude. All right, take it easy, everyone.